Hi, I am Dusky Estes, and I'm the Executive Director of Farm to Pantry. I also am a chef, a rancher, and a farmer. <laughs> if you think you've seen me before, you probably have. Uh, I've been on a number of Food Network shows and PBS shows. Uh, I competed on a show called Next Iron Chef, season three and season five. Uh, I've been a judge on Guy's Grocery Games and on Guy's Ranch Kitchen. Most recently we won Burger Truck Brawl. Uh, very excited about that on Discovery Plus. Um, and I got to go to Hawaii with Guy, so that was kind of a great trip too. I've lived in Sonoma County for 20 years. I grew up in San Francisco. Um, there is no better place to be a chef than Sonoma County because everything grows here. You can get your protein, your lamb, your beef, your chickens, your duck, um, even goat here, uh, and you can get every cheese under the sun that's incredibly made by our artisan cheesemakers. Uh, all of our dairy, we have great eggs, milk, butter, uh, and then all the produce, and of course all the drink. Amazing wineries, amazing breweries, amazing makers of hard cider. So every food and drink has a story, a family story, and you're actually supporting small family businesses rather than big business. Farm to Pantry is a nonprofit that goes onto farms and backyards in Sonoma County and we rescue produce to share with marginalized families. Farm to Pantry gleans on over 100 properties in Sonoma County. We work in people's backyards and we also work on a number of farms, including this farm right here, which is Jackson Family Farms at the Kendall Jackson Winery in Santa Rosa. Saving produce for people who are hungry is amazing in its multiple ways of giving. For the food that's produced in the United States, 40% of it goes to waste, and 10% of greenhouse gas emissions are attributed to food waste. So this is actually a place where you can make a difference. If you fight and combat food waste, you can actually combat global warming. Every farm produces more than it actually needs, in order to go to market. And there are generally items that are not good for sale. So they might not be the right size, they might be just too ripe. You know, there's a number of reasons why food doesn't get sold in the marketplace. Uh, in the pandemic, there was actually an added complication, which is that the food distribution system broke down. Uh, we're very tightly knit in Sonoma County. Our restaurants and our farms uh, were known for our tight connection and the farm to table movement. And so when the restaurants shuttered, uh, there was a lot of food out there and it wasn't worth it for the farmers to pay the labor to harvest. So what Farm to Pantry does is bring volunteers. We have over 300 volunteers that glean on over 350 properties and then we share it with 100 community partners. So we make sure that the food doesn't go to waste and actually feeds hungry bellies. Local visitors can join Farm to Pantry by volunteering, and it's very simple to volunteer. It's three hours in one morning, and you harvest either on a backyard or on a farm. You get to see sort of the inside scoop of what Sonoma County is really like. We're on amazing, beautiful properties all over. And then that same day, that food gets distributed. The gratification that you feel is immediate. If you want to come to Sonoma County, you can book on kindtraveler.com. That's a place where you can select a nonprofit to give to. Please select Farm to Pantry. And you can give directly at farmtopantry.org or join us on a glean on that same site.